Howdy ho, everybody. We are here on Amazon Islands Farm. Take a look at the PDA. Let's take a look at the PDA better way. We've got ourselves a whole bunch of little islands. Three, four, six, seven, eight. Ten little islands here in the Amazon River. We are right near the Amazon River. And uh, we have quite the geo enabled. I've got the uh, the geo turned on on this one, and uh, we're gonna have ourselves a good old time. Just landed here from uh, Rocky Mountain Farms, where it is cold. We're up vi visiting Genetic J earlier, and he's got about three feet of snow up there. It's uh, having a whole heap of a problem trying to keep uh, snow out of the way. Hey Ed, hey Fabio, what's up Will? Genetic J, I see you have uh, snuggled up and uh, hopefully gotten out of the freezing. Hey Raznik, hey Talgar, what's up? Yeah, we have uh, 72 degree ground temp here. And let's go ahead and check out this custom geo we got working here. So we've got a South American geo for sure. Because you can see, uh, we're going to have to go a whole year before we can harvest any wheat or barley um, or canola or sunflowers uh, we've we can't plant them until autumn or winter so we have to go the whole year before we can actually plant those crops and then we get to the next year where we can actually then harvest uh, we can plant harvest and we can plant soybeans and corn right away and I was looking at this <clears throat> and typically we can double crop like in the Midwest geo we can double crop wheat and soybeans or wheat and corn uh, because we can plant wheat early harvest it in early to midsummer and then drop our soybeans or corn down real fast and get those done before the end of autumn but on this geo it looks like you might be able to double crop soybeans and corn pretty easy if we plant soybeans right away, it's like we can harvest those and then still plant corn and then still get corn out of the field uh, to turn around and then plant possibly corn back in it or soybeans back in it. Which is an interesting um, flip. We can do sugarcane year round, plant it or harvest it year round non-stop sugar cane production if we want and look we can uh we can harvest grass pretty much year round except for this one little period here so this is a rather interesting geo uh to work with uh ccs 101 is the map author of this particular map and i have literally just jumped in set seasons paused the game so everything you see is starting equipment or the starting state of fields if you were uh, doing seasons. We've got this uh, interesting dirt color. It's kind of a, a light dirt color. Start out with two greenhouses here on the uh, map. And we start, if you have the manure buy zone, uh, you start with the manure buy point over here. Uh, so if that's in your mod folder when you fire up, you've got that. And, uh, here is the manure fork as part of that buy point. Let's uh, top in our pickup and let's go for a proper ride around the uh, around the place. I might need to uh, whip out my my helicopter fly around here. First thing you're going to notice once we get down here to the water is the water is brown and muddy. From from the uh, from the early screenshots that I I got to see the uh, the muddy water that was that was one of the high points actually. It's not seeing dirty was was seeing the dirty water and not the clean water. There are beehives on the map also. Uh, I'm hoping there is a ferry down here. 
Otherwise, we're going to have to uh, phone home. Uh oh. <clears throat> Saw to prove interesting. If you uh, if you play this map with uh, with tabbing disabled, that's all awful uh, interesting. Barry is not here. You have some shipping lanes. Uh, we do have animated uh, boats here, fishing boats, and uh, transport boats. Let's figure out where our ferries are. Take a look. Two. Let's use this one. Hey, Bert. Hey, Darren. All right, let's the road so unlike uh, some other maps that you uh, may have played that involved a ferry in this one we can pretty much drive wherever we want now like on Rathlin Island you have to uh, pretty much stay within a very narrow uh, lane in order to uh, drive around else we will uh, sink the ship but uh, with with this map, that's not a problem. Partially because the uh, well, water is so muddy you can't really see the bottom. And two, uh, there's an interesting trick that Will has done to uh, basically allow. Oh, well, we gotta not get our propellers in the uh, beads there. Basically, to allow us to um, pretty much drive wherever. And thankfully. The ferry is a little bit faster. Uh, we're running 32 mile an hour. I think the best the ferry can do on Rathlin is like 16. Now, it is kind of interesting um, dealing with the uh, fishing and shipping traffic here on the map. Basically having uh, those boats move around and basically having to move around them. It's, it's a little bit different than having to do with having to deal with uh, um, you know, AI traffic. I'm sure, you can't turn off the boats. Hey, Raznik, what's up? And, oh, look at that. Stocks are a little bit bigger than the ones on Rathlin, too. They're a lot easier to uh, hit. Just do a little island hopping. <laughs> knocked out in a week. <laughs> oh, he's not been knocked out in a week. I tried to do course play with the uh, the ferry on Rathlin. I wasn't very successful. I assume you could do it. We need two fairies because we're going to destroy one. Hey, Rabbit Sean, what's up?
So our first um, island of destination is our magical levitating dog. Told Will about that earlier today. Kinda levitates and uh, <laughs> walks through cars. <laughs> Got ourselves sheep. Now we got. I'm sure the Graze mod is in here. And yep, bug bug about uh, bug with Graze mod and seasons. Clearly, we don't have any grass growth here. No, grass is not grown here. So even though we have grass, I'm sure it's it's just a, a fluke of probably how the Graze mod is currently coded. Um, with it being early spring, it's probably thinking, oh, there's no grass there, so, uh, no grass there. We're gonna have to, uh, do I have buy bales in here? I do. Oh, I do. Buy some hay bales. And we have quite the fleet of equipment on the map because of all these islands. They pretty much all have their own stuff they need. Fuel tanks that we're going to need to fill. So make sure they have water. Watch out for the dolphins. Watch out for the underground uh, piranha. Got a little uh, little grass field down here for the uh, for the sheep. Actually, no, it is knocked down. Gonna have to wait for the uh, for the grass to grow. All right. Uh, it's not quite public yet. Nope. Just, uh, just hit the, uh, just hit the, uh, oh, we got some rocks underneath. I'm gonna bottom out. We gotta be careful. Out for the shipping. Yeah, fishing boats. <laughs> Went over here to the uh, Cow Island. I do like how these docks have been uh, been upsized a little bit. The ones on Rathlin are really, really narrow. These make uh, docking a heck of a lot easier. Of course, they all have fuel on them because uh, well, ferry needs fuel. I'm gonna run it out. It'll be stuck. Just an I-beam. <laughs> oh, 
Those bleed, yeah, that's definitely definitely the case. Uh, when the map will be out? Uh, probably, I don't know, in uh, in a week or two. Let's see. It's at this point, it's it's down to uh, testing and seeing, you know, what uh, how things have come together and everything. Kind of a map shakedown. Now I do know uh, we start out. Where's the water trough? You know, with with the cows, we start out with some TMR actually in the mixer, which is rather interesting. I have I I would have annihilated the boat many times over at this point. It's the Jeez, this one. Jeez, the little hurlerman. Yeah, I don't like to get in any water that I can't see to the bottom of uh so definitely i'm not swimming in these water oh you also start with a straw bale I did see the bottom has a nice sandy texture. I'll show that off here in a little. Isn't that nice? The farmer we take the uh, take over for has left us um, power food here on the uh, on the farm. Right. Oh, um, let's go ahead. We got a little uh, water land bridge over here. Forgot that you for oh was the uh, was the TMR not supposed to be in there? Well, I done showed everybody. Now you got to keep it. I did, I did, uh, I did jump ferry over this <laughs> earlier today. I was wanting to see what would happen, and I, uh, I took this at full speed and <laughs> jumped the ferry. <laughs> and look, 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 um, Darren, we've got Lone Oak, Lone Oak, um, Amazon style. Now that was a grass field. This is fake. Because pretty sure this is indestructo grass. Uh, whereas the field that we were just in with the lone oak, that is a real deal because it's been mowed down. Uh, Resnick, you'll you'll see that each uh, each island kind of has its own little theme going on. As far as uh, buildings go, I think.
All right, let's, let's head on over. We're just going to do a little tour the islands here. So we've been to those two. Let's head over here to this uh, complex. See if we can um, find our way around the island. Hey, duck, what's up? We've got a geo almost to your liking. We can mow grass almost year round. We've got one one uh, transition where we can't mow grass. And we got 24, we got 365 harvest and planting of uh, sugar cane down here. <clears throat> Your way around the coast. And all of the cell points are uh, over there on that island with the lighthouse. I think. There we go. Now we're making our way around to the chicken farm. So the career start point is up there by field 8. And we've been to the sheep island and the cow island. <laughs> oh, Let's zoom it out a little bit. So one surefire way of figuring out where the dock is on the map is where the uh, where there's a fuel trigger uh, by the water. That's going to be the dock. Yeah, this is exactly how the map is. I didn't change anything. I didn't I didn't even add money. Just jumped in the game in hard mode and set 3-day seasons. Not hit the cat. Got a uh, seagull it's flying overhead, but uh, thankfully we don't have them squawking. Now we have the um, chicken farm. Quite the big farm for the chicken farm. that I've got another one of those we're gonna have here in a while. I'm gonna buy one of these here in a little bit. Place our run down one. So we do have the map does have the enhanced chicken. Enhanced chickens in here so we can uh, always have a couch outside don't we gonna have the air conditioner running chickens or where are the chickens
want to straw we don't have we really oh, we got, we got stuff in the crops in the silo don't we do it on hard mode we got some stuff there for our critters have to figure out where our uh, wheat and barley is I don't have the uh, I don't have the tablet app in so I can't check that out fishing mod you know there is a placeable um, fishery oh look at these see those on my first uh, walk around and this is that classic building we uh, house we can walk around in got oversized toilets and stuff for some reason it's got a picture of Britney Spears upstairs <laughs> is um what is this giant trigger here is this where is this where we can put placeables where what's this giant trigger there's only one spot on the map where we can put a placeable. That is related to can't put it there. What that? I really don't know what that is. Maybe Will can. Uh... Oh, it's for my helicopter. I'm going to need to buy. Okay. Uh, due to how the uh, the ferry works, so the real ferry typically actually um, drives around on a giant imaginary or a giant invisible wheel. Um, <clears throat> that's why, like on Rathlin, there is a narrow shipping lane that has a shallow um, bottom, so the ferry actually rolls on the shipping lane floor. Um, and if you drive off the shipping lane, the boat sinks. The boat's not actually floating on anything. But on this map, what Will has done is uh, we've got bedded uh, straw stacks and haystacks scattered around the map. But what Will's done is what he told me is the whole map has a collision just under the uh, just under the water surface that the uh, that the ferry rides on and as such you can pretty much just drive around wherever but the problem is then that there is a tip tip collision I guess um, on most of the map where you can't put uh, can't put placeables the only place you can put placeables is over at the career start point another nice island here with uh, mowable grass Oh, is there a uh, sunken bust under the bridge, too? Let's go check that out. Can't get... Hold her breath. Hold her breath. Water breath. Any survivors? This thing has been long buried. Yeah. Oh, I gotta come up. I'm running out of breath. Uh oh. Might die under the water. Oh, I made it out. Okay. Whew. Really a bad swimmer. Don't do that again. Oh, uh, yeah, the DLC map did have that. I was thinking about. Um, um, Spectacle Island had uh, had that. 
really want to plow up some ground here because it looks like we've got a interesting uh, custom uh, dirt color. Maybe this is where I jumped the ferry. I don't know. I jumped the ferry off of one of these. <clears throat> we do have sugarcane already here on the uh, on the map. I'll show you the uh, starting equipment here in a moment. So I've done nothing other than uh, just jump in the game and start driving around. And just like other maps that uh, Will has done, if you have uh, DL some DLCs, you're going to get some free starting equipment. Hey, Henry, what's up? Probably, probably where we could put our sugar cane once we harvest it. Oh, you know, it'll be a fine day when uh, when weeds don't come through trucks and other things. Well, Do you like this muddy water? What do you all think of the water? Gonna have to, uh, we're gonna have to sell this truck. We're gonna tear it up. Fail storage scattered around. We'll, uh, find it. Find it much. Here. Now, this island over here already has a ferry, so we're going to have to uh, kind of move it out of the way. Oh, does it? We could check that out here later. How's mine? I haven't been able to touch mine in, since, uh, I don't know, the weekend. This is Monday. I've been able to touch mine since, uh, I don't know, when last time it Saturday? Work on it some Saturday morning. Oh, it was just.
this one rolling. And then we'll abandon ship. Quick, let's get to land before I run out of breath. Oh, up on the rocks. Out. Let the suffocate. Died. Oh, now we're gonna have to find the uh, the fishing wreck. That'll be fun to find during while we're waiting on something to grow. This would be a good uh, map to use at start position save. You save your uh, your starting point. This is the, um, here's the arable island. <clears throat> Some seed and fertilizer here. Uh, don't jump in the water. It might, there is a, a nasty, um, downdraft that keeps you, uh, keeps you down. Not a strong swimmer. Like I was saying, it seems like every every map, every island has its own kind of unique uh, unique feel. Or 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 tractor. Baby wheels on it. <laughs> yeah, we're not having to, uh, all fuel around with the ferry. Don't want to have a uh, a natural disaster where we uh, lose a tank of fuel uh, in the river. Run back. Hop on in there. <laughs> There's the ferry. Someone didn't tie the ferry up very well, and it uh, well, it managed to. Um, someone left it running too. Back up, back up, back up, back Can I, can I follow, can I use follow me on the ferries? I don't think I can follow me on the ferries. Man, that would be convenient. Oh wait, oh wait, I did. Oh, we got a uh, lady ferry captain in there. Let's see, come on. 
Let's go. Not following me. I wonder if it's following the truck. Oops. Oh, there is a collision there. Oh, look, map boundary, map boundary. Let's go around the other way then. Is, was that is that related to follow me no breadcrumbs unless on terrain hey John what's up So pretty much all of your cell points are over here on this island. Oh, slow down. We're going to crash. Oh. And if you like to use auto load, you're going you're going to gonna not like it auto load on the uh, ferries is of a pain some of our starting equipment the old uh, the old trash pile over here by the uh, by the shop Pig food silo for bulk pig food. Sell points for sugar beet, potatoes, and sugar cane. Oh, this is pretty cool. I looked in here earlier. Got our scale platform. And in here. We have some agricultural magazines. Right there. And then we got, um, this is pretty cool. We got uh, like grain, grain moisture, moisture checkers. And then we got some people who can't keep their fingers off the screen. We got some really dirty computers here with extremely dirty screens dirty seat I mean these guys just need to change their clothes and wash their hands or something Hey, country girl, what's up? Got our animal buy point here. 
some logs, cell points, milk, cell point, egg, cell point. Pretty much everything you want to sell is over here on this, uh, this island. It is dust and dirty. Well, you know what? They, they're not jumping in the river. That's for sure. I did like this. A straw and wood chips go in the grinder. And this is not a lighthouse we can climb, is it? Uh, no, at this point in time, this, uh, I don't know, this, uh, no, there's a whole time, there's a whole bunch of custom scripts and stuff going on here. Uh, but it would be interesting to, uh, well, the ferry, the ferry probably precludes all of that. Cell point four. All right. Let's take a look at the starting equipment before I sell off this truck. So as it stands right now, um, here's your starting equipment. You start with a whole fleet of um, tractors. One, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, fifteen, thirteen base tractors, and Fourteen. Fourteen tractors, including the JCB Fast Track from the Modern Classics. We have front loader arms, buckets, pallet spikes, bale spikes, two harvesters, headers, trailer, tippers, cultivator, plow, cedars, plus stuff, whole gambit of weights. Basically start with everything. Everything you'd ever want. Mowers. Water trailers, a whole bunch of bee houses to give you extra money, a couple greenhouses to keep up and running, sprayers, and then from the platinum expansion, you get the sugarcane planter, sugarcane harvester, sugarcane tipper. Then, if you have the manure placeable, the manure store in. You have that with your starting equipment, and you've got the grapple. Those are going to be useful for your greenhouses. And then two ferries. This is not the uh, main ferry. This is a modded ferry for the map. Get two of them. Let's get the farming. All right, we need a Since we started with seasons, we can take out a big loan. Just keep cranking that up there. See how much we can owe before the end of the year. Oh gosh, that ought to be enough. Trailer.
Well, let's just get one of these for now. It's a little weird. All right. You're going to see all the funness that relates to this ferry and auto load. Only catch is to not unload something on an auto load trailer while it is on the ferry. So if I do this, this is how I would typically play. Okay. I've auto loaded the items and now I have uh, unloaded them to the center and strapped them down. All right. We're going to take these over to the sheep. Okay, they go on okay. Unload, you're in trouble. I, unlo I unloaded on purpose. Show you all. So the reason you have issues with auto load is... Uh-oh. Oh no, I can't see the boat. It's supposed to yield to the bigger boat, but um no, we don't. Uh this is a standard 2x map. But uh most of it is water. So the issue with autoload in the ferry is the ferry has a little locking script to lock things on. And I found that if you turn off the tractor, um, the ferry is less apt to, uh, the ferry is less apt to um, slide around. Not the ferry, but the thing on the ferry, the load. If you, um, if you leave the, the truck or tractor on and drive around, at least the ferry on Rathlin Island, the the item has a, a tendency to slide around the on the ferry, which isn't really cool. But what you'll see is, what we run into is a problem with um... The locking script will grab the uh, load that's on the trailer, and we won't be able to uh, won't be able to um, get off the ferry at that point until we auto load until we use the auto load script to. Uh, to basically load the bales back on the auto load trailer. There we killed some speed. Hey Anthony, what's up? Oh, the things. Now the ferries come undocked. Quick, dock the ferry again.
Oh, it didn't grab a hold of it this time. Usually it grabs a hold of what you auto-loaded and won't let you take it off. I need to think about how uh, how we're coming off the ferry as much as getting into the ferry dock. Really should have backed the uh, ferry in so that we were uh, so that we were facing the right direction. Hey, Dirty Tractor, what's up? Uh-oh. There we go. See if we got some bale storage around. Yeah, this is from the uh, Modern Classics DLC. Don't know if you've got that one. There we go, we put them back. Thing doesn't seem to have a very tight turning radius. Alright, let's drop this off. Got our wool coming out. Now we gotta go feed our pigs before we worry about doing some field work. Yep, we got pigs. Pig Island. Have any equipment on the pig island or do we have to bring it all over? Got solar cells on our pig shed. That. I'm not seeing any equipment over here. Let's see. Let's check in here. Now this. This particular shed, the door opens really slow. So if you try to open it and it doesn't open, uh, just give it a little bit. Open up. This. Oh. Oh, look at that gift. We got a trailer full of pig food. What a gift. Isn't that nice? I mean, that is a huge present. Not have to worry about pig food. So we got some already. I already put water in there. Fill it. Those lights. All right, let's see here. 
All of our animals have food and water now, so we can get some real work. Water, food, straw. Straw. Look at this. In track with dualies all around. Go get straw. Our pigs and cows. We had a trailer full of TMR. We had a free straw bale. We had a trailer full of power food or um, pig food. Now the, uh, I don't know if it's because it's got a load in it, but you can see maybe it's just this dock, but uh, we had a hard time coming up to this dock. It's either the uh, ferry is riding a little bit too low or the dock itself is a little bit too high here. Let's see if we have a hard time getting into another dock. Back over to the shop. Over there. This JCB must be super heavy then. There's the uh, there's the pig landing. Got quite the hill to get up there to uh, to get up to the pig area. Got a silo over there. I wonder if the silo has uh, probably has the crops in it we need. Um, straw. See that we uh, only the front wheels of the trailer are working at the moment. Got uh, a bit of a load. The hitch on this tractor is kind of low. Let's see if we have the same luck with uh, this load as we did the other load.
on the track. Just head on back. And we're just going to the pigs. I'll have to run over to. Oh, we don't need to run this load over the cows yet. I guess we could. They'll need to straw before the uh, pigs do. if those uh, fishing boats ever get any, uh, any fish. Oops, you know what? We need a back end. We need to be in the right position to get off of this uh, ferry. See, the uh, the fairy has decided to grab those bales. Stuck. Until we auto load it, probably. Oh no. All right, let's see here. Can we make the hill? Can we make the hill? Oh, this is a big hill. I don't think we're going to be able to make it. Yeah, that's what I had to do on Rathlin. Keep it warm. It got stuck. Oh, we made her. Made her. I want to roll the load down into the uh, into the water. Where is the? It's gonna be over here if it's a standard farm sim area. Strong. Couldn't get the pump to pump it any higher than there, eh? <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, that would be that would be pretty bad if there was. Hey, wait, we're we're in the uh, tropics. What what's the percentage of rain? Let's check the forecast. Oh, good grief! We don't have rain every day. It's a blessing. I was worried we'd have rain every day. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, right now the map's got a lot of uh, custom scripts in it. Uh, like this ferry, for example. That uh, would preclude it from being on console. So the only way to get around is uh, is via the ferry here. That is a uh, customed custom mod. Yeah, the islands are challenging uh, because you know it makes it makes quick run runs to the store pretty difficult. Let's go on over here. Uh, you can see though the fairy has grabbed those bales. The fairy thinks it's got the bales at this point. If it keeps a hold of those bales, uh, we're going to have to auto load the uh, bales again in order to make it release. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh. See, it's released those bales, so we're probably going to be okay. Oops, we forgot the gate. All right. Let's see here. Is there square bale storage anywhere? Or is it just round bale storage over here? That is done. I want to get a little farming Lamborghini tractor. Let's see if we can plow. Where is the plow? Probably not on this island. Probably somewhere else. Oh, goody, the plow is on this island. I wanted to see the plow texture. Plowing away. Now 
Now, I really don't like these plows, but uh, uh, we'll use it. We'll use what we got. Yeah, I'm probably plowing backwards, but switch it. Either that, I was plowing the right direction, and now I'm plowing backwards. Switch. Well, they both probably used the same amount of fuel. Right? That's a darn scrolly thing in. Oh, I can't turn that off, can I? A very interesting texture. Not what I was expecting, but okay. You, uh, Genetic J, you are funny. Yeah, you know how many trips I'd have to take across the ferry to get more manure from the manure by point, which is over there by field eight? <laughs> you are funny. <laughs> I know I'm not going to manure the field. Which one of these switches you all set? There we go. Auto offset reverse. What? Yeah, I wasn't expecting that. I was kind of expecting something with uh, with furrows in it. Go over here to the need file state. It would be, but that wouldn't be the, uh, that wouldn't be the texture, though. Yeah. Let's go grab a cultivator and let's, let's cultivate and see what that looks like. state is this it's in a uh, cultivated state is that why we is that why the hired helper doesn't want to plow it because it's cultivated work this this seven that Oh, what's up with that?
We'll start this guy off, and then we're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go cultivate something and just see. What, oh, where's the start point? You and work. Let's go get another tractor. Let's see what the cultivation looks like. You make a perfectly fine point, Will, but you know what? It's more fun to actually do it. To cultivate. I should not be here on the island. To be somewhere else. Oh, there's a cultivator in somewhere. Where is it? It's over on the chicken farm. All right, well, let's go spray. Let's use some fertilizer. I'm still I'm still laughing inside inside at uh, Genetic J's um, request to uh, manure the field. <laughs> See that? This spur have an animation. I need. Obviously, if you have the coon pack, then, uh, then you have this uh, sprayer. Really cool sprayer to begin with. give you a little bit. I'll get the big, big bud uh, manure spreader and I'll use that. That should be able to spread manure on all the fields. There we go. 
Hey, Pragmatic Bliss. Play like day. What's up? Oh, yeah. That is true. It probably won't fit on the ferry, will it? Turned on the auto spring. Oh, I'm just here trying out a new map in what we can break. Seeing what doesn't work like expected. Uh, there is two heliport helipads for helicopters. None of the islands are big enough to support a, an airplane uh, runway. Well, that's an idea. See if we can't buy one after we, uh, we get done this field. Let's figure out what uh, tractor will be able to pull it. Oh, we could use that one. What? Here's the problem. We have to uh, the shop is on the east side of the map, East Island, and the uh, manure is on the West Island. So we're gonna have to. Uh, we're going to have to get both on the ferry, cart them over to the West Island, get them off, load them up, get it back on the ferry, and then um, tool it around the place for uh, um, for working. Oh, that's an idea, Darren. Interesting map for uh, Farm Sim 19's um, 
buildable farms. Oh, I could. I can put a placeable at the shop on that island. I thought the only place I could do it was over by the uh, other island. Oh, slow down, slow down, slow down. We're not slowing down fast enough. Oh, man. Fishing boat sure does come close. <laughs> this is not going to work. This is so not going to work. <laughs> So we're going to need both fairies for this. We're going to have to put the spreader on one fairy, back it out of the way, put the tractor on the other fairy. Yeah, but uh, I don't have a tractor that can, uh, I don't think I have anything on any of the other islands that can pull it off. So we're going to need to uh, put the tractor on this other ferry, and then bring it over to an island, take it off, bring the manure over, hook it up and pull it off. And uh, see if there's maybe a sneaky way to get up to the uh, fields on the pig farm. Oh, the manure barge. Definitely. I know I could have went with a smaller spreader, but this is fun. better slow down. I wonder if I can just beach it. I can load it just by beaching it. <laughs> so I can't. Just 
jump off. Oh, here we get our full load. huge. I don't think I've ever used this huge one other than other than when I was testing out the DLC. I need to stretch this, uh, stretch the ferry, make it longer. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> that was... <laughs> the whole world is shaking. Oh, we, we might blow the game up. The game, <laughs> the game might just explode. That, that was the one thing I didn't want to do. Oh, it's stuck. Can't go anywhere. Done shaking. <laughs> oh, it's got the shakes. Got the shimmies. Okay, let's quick, let's get off the island. <laughs> Oops. That's the one thing I didn't want to do is lower those gates. And the first thing I do is lower the gates. <laughs> That's too much time on Rathlin where I'm lowering the gates constantly. Might have more than a shipwreck in the uh, in the river before we're done. Someone ever more realistic the uh, the ferry come around here too quick? I guess the ferry's going to capsize. Not looking good. Whole world shaking. See, it's, it's locked. The ferry still has it locked. Let's try this.
Oh, we did. <laughs> I think we did it. We did it. We did it awful. Or what happens if we do that? Other than losing all the manure. <laughs> well, we do have a little manure spreader. I just saw it fly by. Oh, look, we're back where we started. I was stuck. Gates were down. I couldn't get them back up. Because the, the ferry wouldn't let go of the... Uh, wouldn't let go of it. Thanks for the sub, IH Power. I promise you, not every stream is <laughs> as as ludicrous as this one. <laughs> uh, let's try let's try that again. Except let's make sure we don't uh, we don't lower the gates. Everything went well until we lowered the gates. Then that's when we had a problem. <laughs> that's definitely how the water got brown. <laughs> we got to remember what we're doing here. Well, at least you're starting with a bunch of equipment. Not like uh, Rathlin Island where you start with a Hurlerman and you literally have to cart everything you buy across the ferry. Alright, we are not going to lower the gates. <clears throat> we are not going to lower the gates. Right. 
Remember, we are not going to lower the gates. What are we not doing? We're not lowering the gates. Oh. Lift the lift those, but we're not gonna lower the gates. Uh what, the trick of loading the uh, manure spreader with it? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We've already got, well, this ferry probably had some hours on it. I was going to say, we've already got 0. 0.9 hours on the ferry. It doesn't work on every uh, spreader. The in-game ones, for sure. Some of the mod ones it doesn't work on. They'll even work on most tippers. Most trailers uh, will fill from there also. Yeah, I think if you MR this ferry, should capsize if you uh, turn too quick. I mean, that's the key feature of MR is that uh, it causes you to roll things. Good. All right, we made it. <clears throat> we did it. Now, part of the experiment will see how many fields we can get done with this. Doesn't turn very sharp. Yeah, I mean, if we could put a manure placeable down on every island, well, that would be one thing. Tractor sure does have the shimmy and shakes.
Lean down. Roof. <laughs> it's... <laughs> yeah, it's suffering. Or the problem. Well, I definitely don't think it's going to do every field, but of course, I think field four is the biggest one on the map. Well, three. Three's bigger, but three's got something growing in it. Well, three's got sugarcane, right? I do have the manure mod in, so this will uh, give us two stages once we plow it. Interesting. Getting stubble as we drive over the field. That is odd. Seeing those lines down on the PDA. Barley ready. It's obviously not ready. And harvested. Obviously a cultivated color, cultivated state. Where we've driven, it's now listed as harvested. All right, guys. Well, we are going to uh, we're going to finish up this uh, this field with our manure, and then we're going to uh, we're going to call it an evening. Going, we're approaching our two-hour mark. It is nearly 11:30 my time. Hey, Alien Jim, got another island map here. Amazon, Amazon uh, Island Farms. 
got what six little islands to deal with and uh, just for funsies we brought the, uh, the big bud manure spreader over on the ferry she barely fit and uh, if you want to see what happens when you accidentally lower the gates down on the manure spreader you'll have to scroll back about a half hour <laughs> Well, it's uh, well, it's super early for you probably, and it's 11:30 uh, p.m. for me. Yeah, we had some issues when we lowered the gate on the on the spreader. Let's just let's put it over here and get some weird texturing with this one. No. Just that other field. We're getting stubble. We were going from ready state, which we shouldn't have had to begin with, to a uh, harvested state. Palm trees? Go check those out real quick before we end. Our palm trees. All their banana trees. That's what we need. That's what we need on Farm Sim. We need a banana factory. Make bananas. Steam. surface. Alright guys, well like I said, it's uh, it's 11.30 my time. We're going to go ahead and close her out. But uh, yeah, Alien Jim, if you want to see some hilarity, uh, scroll back through the archive once it's up and uh, see where I accidentally lowered the gate on the manure spreader and caused the whole world to shake. I mean, we had, we had just terrible Terrible time. Till next time, happy farming.